Welcome to Brett Ridgeway's Learning for Life Jam 2020. This is Lesson 2, Part 2 of I'll Fly Away, where we're going to talk about the chords of the tune, break it down, and put it together with the song. And I don't think I'm going to actually put the chord names on top. I will call them out, but I don't think I'm going to put them out where you see them, simply because this is very easy. It follows the same chord pattern as what I refer to as the boil them cabbages down. So it'll be G, C, G, D, and G. And uh, at this point, we need to start hearing the chord changes. Even though I will call them out, uh, you'll, you'll hear it by the phrase. Before we start, I want to thank my patrons for making these lessons possible. I couldn't do it without their help. Uh, this this program is supported strictly by donations. It's the only way that I can do this without charging. And uh, this gives you a 24-7 uh, library that you can refer to going back to other lessons, older lessons. Uh, as a patron, you do have access to certain patron-exclusive lessons that I've had in the past. And uh, also to a one-hour uh, live stream workshop every single month which gives you kind of an inner circle and get to talk with other people on the, in, the, in the group and other people that you might not know. And uh, just a very nice little community. And that, that starts at the $5 entry level. So any help, any consideration would be appreciated to keep this lesson program going. So thank you, patrons. So let's get started. We're going to be in G. Last week we learned the melody of the tune. And when we're in G... Uh, I'm going to show you just different patterns, but here's your G, here's your triangle, there's a box chord, and in the melody, if you remember, we did a fill-in where we did a left flag. That's all, that's all part of a G chord. If we did a C chord, we could do that same thing up here. If we did a C chord, we could do that same thing. If we did the D chord, which is going to be a lot quicker. So you could go from G to C, G, D. You can also do that within a box. Here's your G, which is one, three, and five. One, four, and six is your C. Back to your G, and then your D. So we're going to get started on the tune. You will have a two, and this is going to be very slow, uh, a two uh, measure count in of uh, eight beats. And then we're going to start with G. I'll call out the chord changes, but I'm going to use some combination of what I just showed you. And we'll play this through three different times. One, two, three, starting with G. Staying in the box of G up to C, same thing, same pattern, down to G, G, sing the words in your head, and it'll help you find your chords, G, D, G, into the chorus now, G, up to C, down to G. Starting again. 
again. We're going to switch a little bit here. give you your own practice track and I'm going to still call out the chords but I'm not going to play uh, but I gave you some ideas there I, I followed just the box then we did the left flag into the box or starting with the box going back down same here we did the same thing up in C and the D you don't really have time to do so much but you get the idea there. So I'm going to give you your own practice track and I will call out the chords for you. Here we go. G, here we go. Up to C. Back down to G. Still G. G, D, G. This is all G as we go into the second part. G, 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 C. Back to G. This is all G. G. 
G. G, D, G. Okay, try it on your own. Here we go, starting with G. When it goes into I'll Fly Away, you go to your C, right here. Back to the verse again, not the refrain there. We're in G. That last phrase, I'll fly as D. Way back to G. The second I'll fly away right here is C. Back to G. G, D, G. You're all on your own. Here you go, starting with G. So I'm going to give you one more practice track. I'm going to play the backup, then the melody, and then the backup. Four G.
backup. Or you can be doing the melody if you want. Sorry about that. I'm going to jump the gun there. So, well, see how you did on that? I'm going to give you one more practice track. No comments, no chord uh, call out, no hints, and just let you play with this on your own. I'm going to bid you farewell at this point. Uh, I do want to thank my patrons again for all their help, for their support. Anyone who might consider becoming a patron, please leave a comment. Please like on YouTube and uh, please share these lessons. Thank you so much for watching and uh, we'll see you next week. Here is your last practice track. <laughs>